Now, Wave 31 Storm Tracker Chief Meteorologist Taylor Knust with 31 Triple Doppler. No pressure, Taylor, but uh, everybody <laughs> wants decent weather. You're all counting on me. Okay. <laughs> uh, it looks like we are going to be dry. Good. It yeah, is, so. it's hot and dry, right? Yeah, exactly. The, the heat's going to be an issue for sure, but uh, no rain outs expected in Fort Payne uh, for to June Jam tomorrow. Yeah, that's uh, definitely good news for folks heading out there on Saturday. But as for today, we got plenty of rain out there. Some of it was welcome uh, after a couple of dry weeks we've had across the Tennessee Valley. Here's the time lapse from Muscle Shoals earlier this afternoon. You see those towers going up and then eventually it all came back down as heavy rainfall in the shoals. Couple rounds moved through today. Uh, some of it ended up being pretty heavy with totals near an inch for some spots. So it was a nice soaking rain uh, for parts of North Alabama earlier this afternoon. These are radar estimated totals from today. Muscle Shoals to Russellville over an inch of estimated rainfall there about a half inch in Town Creek close to an inch in Hillsborough. So we head toward Madison County was uh, the haves and the have nots. The northern part of the county close to a quarter to a half inch of rainfall. The city of Huntsville southward, not much rain at all today. And uh, I know some of those lawns are getting uh, a little bit thirsty. That's for sure. And we'll be uh, wanting a little bit rain here before too long. But as of right now on 31 triple Doppler, we are all dry and it's going to stay that way the rest of the night. A comfortable night with temperatures in the low 70s in the Rocket City, 68 in Gunnersville and 68 at this hour in Muscle Shoals. Overnight lows will be in the low to mid 60s, including 64 in the Rocket City. Heading into Saturday, here comes the heat, even more so than what we saw earlier today. Quickly warming up to 89 by noon. It's going to be plenty hot enough by that point to hop into the pool, and it's going to be a toasty afternoon across North Alabama. For those of you heading to Fort Payne for June Jam, here's their forecast high, 89 degrees. Not quite as hot as other parts of North Alabama, but still plenty warm and a lot of sunshine out there as well. Meanwhile, Scottsboro, 91 tomorrow, a high of 89 in New Hope, 91 in Hazel Green, 91 in Decatur. I have 92 in Florence and 91 tomorrow afternoon in Cherokee. Sunday looking about the same, maybe a, a little bit cooler around Sand Mountain with highs back to the mid 80s, but uh, you'll, you'll feel that warmth for sure throughout this upcoming weekend. Huntsville City FC back in action as we head into Sunday evening, and we'll be watching the potential for some storms maybe a round kickoff, which is at 6 p.m. on Sunday. I'll show you that here on future radar. Saturday looks dry across all of North Alabama. Few of those fair little weather clouds popping up in the afternoon, but they are not going to bring us any rainfall. Sunday, different story. After a dry morning, scattered thunderstorms are expected to pop up in the afternoon and could stick around for some of you through the early evening. Severe weather not necessarily anticipated with this, but brief heavy downpours, lightning, and uh, occasional gusty winds will be a possibility with some of those strongest storms. Next week, we stay pretty hot early in the week with low 90s on Monday and Tuesday. Cold front will kick up some showers and storms on Tuesday, and then that should clear out as we head into the middle of the week. And with that cold front passing through, we'll get a slow light break from the high heat highs down to the mid 80s on Wednesday and Thursday overnight lows to the low 60s around that time as well. But we are going to creep up close to 90 by the following weekend.